Let's go to Minnesota now, where the governor has declared a state of emergency for 35 counties there after torrential rain it has caused flash flooding. Look at this picture. This is a mudslide that goes all the way up to the edge of the equipment that is right outside a hospital in Minneapolis. The hill collapsed. It dumped six to eight feet of mud and debris onto the roadway there. And Stephanie Galehard, our Fox Station uh, reporter at KMSP, joins us live. So, Stephanie, what's happening there? Martha, miraculously, no one was hurt in this mudslide, but a really scary situation. I mean, if you can imagine, two people were driving here on West River Parkway in Minneapolis when mud came sliding down this hill behind the University of Minnesota Medical Center. Now there's up to eight feet of debris, mud, and tree limbs lying the road. And Martha, I want you to take a look at that white oxygen canister. Last night, there was a concern that that would topple down the hill. Authorities today are certainly relieved that that didn't happen. And in just the last half hour, we've seen officials up there by the white canister. They were taking photos. They were investigating. And it appears they're trying to figure out where to go next. Now, luckily, this did not affect any patients here at the University of Minnesota Medical Center. However, as a precaution, 20 people in a nearby building were evacuated. And authorities say debris from the mudslide fell into the Mississippi River here. So this could cause problems today for boaters. So boaters are urged to be careful today. This could also cause problems and trouble at the locks and dams. Now, as far as the next step is concerned, structural engineers and park board officials will determine where to go next from here. But at the moment, crews, they just want to let this site settle and dry before they can start the cleanup process. Martha, back to you in the studio. Wow. All right. Thank you very much, Stephanie. Remarkable.